and welcome to Fit for a Feast. My name is Sloan. And my name is Katrina. And today we're here with Erica, who's going to show us how to do our lips for stage. So to apply the lipstick, you'll need both the lipstick and a lip liner. Um, and it's just because the lip liner will allow you to outline the lips so that it will give you a good frame. And it will also not let the lipstick run and stuff like that. So um, you'll usually when you're doing group numbers, you're going to want one color that matches everybody. And it's usually like a very bright red just because, again, you need your lips to stand out on stage. So to do the lip liner, you just kind of want to outline the edge of the lips where you're going to fill in afterwards with the lipstick. What do you do if you make a mistake? Well, it's okay if the line's not perfect just because you're going to be filling it in afterwards with the lipstick and then you can do touch-ups after. But um, if it's a mistake that you can just usually get a Q-tip to fix with or the makeup remover and just start again. So once you're done the lip liner, you're going to move on to filling it in with the lipstick. Um, what's the best way to apply the lipstick? Um, again, it's kind of personal preference, whatever you're most comfortable with. You can either just apply it like a normal lipstick or you can get um, a lip brush and you can just kind of dab it into the lipstick and then apply it this way. Do you ever put lip gloss over it? Um, you can, but you need to be careful because it may run or smudge easier. So if you do that, just be more careful as well. So how do you avoid getting lipstick on your teeth? Well, one trick that I found useful is just to do this. Can you show them? So then any lipstick that's on the inside of your mouth that would get on your teeth would just be on your finger and then you can just wipe it off. So for thinner lips like mine, how would you do it? Um, you just can kind of make fake lips so you would make a line a little bit thicker on the outside. Okay, so you're just going to make the line on the outside of the actual lips so it's going to appear that her lips are bigger than they actually are. If I was thirsty right before I was going to go on stage, what would I do to not, like, smudge the lipstick? Um, try to always have a straw with you or get a straw just because then um, it won't ruin your lipstick. So you can see the way her lips look more full. Thanks for helping me with my makeup. It looks really nice. If you want to see the list of the makeup we use, check out fitforafeast.com. So see you later on Fit for a Feast. Bye. Bye.